And welcome back. Hope everyone's having a good weekend so far. It is Sunday. That means we have a, another historical rules event. This is server one. Server two is being covered by Eagle from the PLN. So make sure you check out his stuff. Um, we have so on this server one a Hagerstown Turnpike. 181 on the server pop. 88 on the defending CSA versus 93 on the attacking Union. We'll start out taking a look at... All right, did they go live? All right, they went live a little bit early to me. All right, Snapperkins is leading the battery over here. We've got two core under Zio Panama, 6LA. We've got another element of two core under Major Braun over here. A13 Georgia under Major Cawthon. And we've got 4th Georgia here under Colonel Owens. And 4th New Jersey under Captain Victor. I catch these guys. And HL under Captain Gene. All right, on the Union team, as we already have some engagements going on here, we click on this. So already we have the 11th MS under PFC Rain. Got Fifth Corps here, and we've got the NYV Six New York here under who is this? Sergeant Hansen. We've got the 11th MS under Pistol Pete. Let's see here, who else do we have? We've got the 88th under Lieutenant Souther. And the 2 USC here under Captain Eddie. Is that everybody? I believe that's everybody. And it looks like 5th Corps is led by uh, Person on Pancake. Company. Take aim. I don't know what happened there. It's usually they start live at 40 and they started. Uh, now this was very weird. I, I don't know. I missed something. Now, keep in mind, there is no sprinting and no bayonets in HRE until the 40-minute mark. The Union is on the defense here, so... Uh, oh, we got a bit of a movement here. Who is this? Looks like Pistol Pete's going to try to bring up the MS to get a better shot at the 4th Georgia. Left and right. Line up, line up, line up. Move up, move up, move up. Advance. Advance. Advance, make sure we're double clicking, guys. There we go. Oh, yeah. Warm up here. Come on, boys. Keep it up, boys. Faster, Use your blocking bow to the advantage. Whoa, 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 whoa. Clarky, what are you flag. doing, man? Shoot that flag. Shoot that flag. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, what you got, man? Oh, oh, that's whoa, a good one. Oh, oh, convention. Whoa, whoa. Hey. Yeah. So we're you can see that Bucket Ball is doing some heavy damage to the 11th MS, but you also have 13th Georgia and 4th New Jersey here, putting in some heavy fire as well. And the 11th MS does not have much left, although here comes Souther. He's going to try his luck. I don't know about these attacks over this open ground here. I don't think this is going to end well. Um, in fact, I think 88th here is about to get smacked here by the 4th Georgia. Eddie's over there. Eddie's not with you. Hello, you Come here, boy. Come here. You missed. Oh. Come here. Oh. Stop, last oh. man. Oh. Stop. Oh. Come here. You missed. Oh. You <laughs> and <laughs> that is the end of that attack. It was not very successful, and the Union has lost a lot of tickets doing so. I can understand the desire to uh, bring up... A oh, looks like 6 LA has some uh, Hardy here as well. I missed those guys. By those rocks up there, those you know those rocks over there, on the opposite side, opposite yeah. side of the top of the hill. Uh, this is not a shot in the dark. Kind of, yeah, we'll see. Okay. We'll stick to the. Yeah. Shoot him. I would call that a shot in the dark. That is how I would describe that shot. See, the unit can try to bring some Artie up. 
So to kind of go over the battlefield again, CSA spawns over there, CSA Artie, point of contention, Union spawn, Union Artie. So a lot of fighting is over this uh, kind of raised ground here. A lot of people call it the hill. I mean, uh, uh, considering, you know, the ground, it's, it's an elevated position. Mississippi? Yeah, yeah. Wait, then bring low. So far, the CSA is doing an excellent job here against the Union. We'll see if the Union can figure out a way out of this problem set. I might consider capping right now, to be honest with you. I think that's exactly what I do. I would go and sit on cap and make the enemy come and attack you in the open without bayonets. And without sprinting for at least a few minutes. Oh, my bad, brother. I know. It's weird. It's weird. It's See, so eleventh got hit by intersecting uh, fields of fire there. That was not good. Meantime, who has rotated out here? Fort Georgia has pushed up a little bit here. Is now getting good flanking fire into this hill position. Owens is not going to stick around. There is a cannon pointed right at him. Oh. Just went off. I think he took a bullet for me. Got a bit of a forward movement by... Who is this? 6LA? Yep, Zio Panama coming up. Trying to get another angle on this hill. By the way, I do the flag so I can see how many are getting shot. Kind of helps me tell. Because I have shit eyesight. Watch the friendlies. Kill up as well. Um, Guys, independent fire in the field. I think independent this uh, forward, uh, you know, movement here by the CSA, even though they're on, they're on the defense, I think this is working out pretty well for them. Oh, nice yeah. shot. Yeah. Nice yeah. shot. Yeah. Nice shooting yeah. here by the HL. Base. Good independent Foul fire. Keep an eye open to the left. Base. That is where you are Foul threatened Foul from. Foul All right, so Gene is going to get his men out of there. Meantime, Souther's going to join up with Eddie and his uh, home guard over here. With me at the double. Staggered. I mean, he is going to move forward. We'll see if this can unhinge some of this CSA defense here and attack from this opposite side. In fact, they have a good opportunity to seize around the point, staying off the point and seize these caissons, either threaten the CSA already or shooting these guys in the back. We'll see if that's what Eddie has in mind here. See, I would not stop on the fence. I think this is a mistake. I would have gone a little bit further. I fucking know it, lad. Into line on the fence line fight well. The fence is not Let's nearly as good cover on. as the caissons are. Then the uh, CSA will take the caissons and have the superior cover. And you also have the problem with the Artie. Ah, they killed a couple of you. Get up, boy. Get up, get up, get up. Good flag. Artie from 88. Put some fire on the target. Let's see what else is going on on the field here. It's like Gene is still looking for an angle, and then we have a new attack angle here for the Union. Much more by 11th MS, this time 5th Corps is moving up as well. Tuck it in close, tuck it in close, gentlemen. Be on the west side of the fence. Hello, Parker. What's up, Parker? We're over on the right side of the fence. Up and over, boys. Not that side. West. Say you want to push the wood? Uh, no, I don't put my bayonet on. No. Stay away. 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 I mean, we could, uh, yeah. we could alternate bodies with 11th over there. You could cap. That might get him out of the woods. They're reforming. 
And you can see they're now running back. Running back. that forward position was not sustainable, and the uh, Union is going to have to fall back. Eddie's got to get out of there pretty quick here, or he's going to get smacked. They're running. Please. Shoot to the, the guys on the fence. Yep, good target selection by Zio. It's time to go, Eddie. Kitchen fire, boss. Kitchen fire. They're running. Back and ball, boss. Back and ball. Hee hee. Yep, off they go. Let's see. So now we got a forward attack here by Fifth Corps trying to catch uh, John, but he is on his way out. Fourth New Jersey kind of poked that a little bit as well. Looks like John will make his way out of there. Jean Valjean. On the left side here. Hold up, hold up, hold up. That's so Union is now at engaged here at the 31 minute mark here. CSA is not yet even halfway down battle ready. This battle is going very much in their favor. But in 50 seconds here, we will go to. Um, Janet Shot coming in. To bayonets and sprinting, we will see how that changes up the battlefield. Excuse me. Eddie Salter, do we want to make a push up to the um, fence, try to take out caissons and cannons? Try to hold there. Right. We were just not there. We just absolutely just right right. right. peppered as uh, like anything. They've got. They're running two guns. Six right New York bayonets. Six. Yes. Bayonets. All right. So Union's got a pretty good concentrated force over here. We'll see what they're thinking of. Here we got 11th MS. Bayonets and sprinting are now live. They made up some ticket differential here. I might have missed an attack here. Hey, love it. There's a lot of rebels looking at you. Damn it, pivot. You can keep it. Hey, love it. Do you want to send it? Hey, got the grass in the bushes now. Steady. Ah! Reload quickly. We could maybe do a volley. This already shot is usually pretty tough unless you're doing like a canister thing. I have him to doing it. I have a forward attack here by Owens. This is risky here. But he is going to catch the fifth core in the side. That was risky, but I think it was worth it. It was a nice sneaky attack here. Very nice job. Very cheeky by the Fourth Georgian Colonel Owens there. Reload. Nice little shot there from Behind us! Behind us, sir! Ah, now you've taken the caissons. Much better this time here. Now you've got both the whole NYV. Along with two USC, has secured this strong point, and now you've got 11th MS coming in here. I would cap point right now, absolutely. Especially with this position here, you have a unit cap point and force them into the open. I would abandon this hill position, absolutely. And we do have some opposition here from Zio. Pull back, pull back, sprint, 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 southeast. But he is going to pull back. Again, I'd, I'd cap right now. Yeah, on the fence where we were last. Right, 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 right. Here's Zio Panama, not Zio Panama, here's uh, Pistol Peak coming up here. Getting some good shots into this other element of two core. But they are getting hit in the side here by Fort Georgia. They have been cheeky with these flank attacks the whole time. Oh, we got another attack going on up here, though, as well. Fifth core here is mixing it in here with HL. Pancake behind. 
behind us. You're about to get stabbed. I'm gonna in the get you, GI. Oh, fuck yeah. And Fort George is going to try to finish the job here and knock off 5th Corps and seize this hill. 13th George is with him. And so is 4th New Jersey. And that will be a successful attack up this hill behind that CSA regiment here. Um, the Union still controls this position over here. But um, the other two elements have been knocked back. Again, I don't know why you're not capping right now. Can you focus fire on the artillery for a couple of seconds? And pen five six, and you'll keep it up. Uh, Eddie's gonna come up here and try to do an ambush here, but he's getting hit here by the fourth Georgia. Fall back to the cannon. They made him pay for that maneuver. Uh, here's eleventh MS is back into it. That even teams. Push up to here. Push up to here. Union, I think, is in a lot of trouble right now. I think they've completely kind of lost the uh, lost the thread here. You know, we're at 25 minutes right now. You're well behind on tickets. At least half of morale state, if not more. Um. We have Fort Georgia here attacking Edwards. into the 11th MS. And another wipe by the Fort Georgia defeating the 11th MS. You have this strong point that you very well did a great job here seizing, but you're not doing anything with it. All right, now here comes 5th Corps. They're going to come up here against HL. Nice shooting by the 5th Corps into the HL, and that will send them rolling back to friendly lines here. But they're going to get exposed on the flank here. Who is this coming up? It is 13th Georgia. And Major Cawthorn, he's going to get some nice flanking fire into him. One vertical post, 13th. Down the road? Keep an eye out there. Uh, their spawns just to the northeast. Let me know if you see them. Opposite side of the road to the southeast. Yep. I took it a little bit too long here to engage this target, though, to be honest with you. Kind of too much. Where are we shooting? Fourth and Jersey coming in to reinforce them. Uh, looks like we got a cap developing now. Eddie, I would not do this again, man. This is... Oh, this is... We'll see if it works this time. He might, because uh, actually their CSA is out. Worked a little bit better that time. Because the enemy was going against the other way here. By the way, that uh, gentleman that you hear speaking, uh, maybe, with the talking about spines and demons, is Mr. Fujifilm. He is a member of the 4th Georgia, currently under command of Colonel Owens in this match. Um, if you are looking for a EU-based regiment that also does some NA events, I highly recommend you take a look at 4th Georgia. They play uh, Friday, Saturdays, and Sundays on the EU times. Um, and I think they do Sunday NA times for War of Secession. But uh, they do a lot of events here. Uh, very good command structure. They have a lot of fun characters in it. So uh, if you're looking for a unit to join, and that sounds like it's your kind of speed, um, I would check out the Fort Georgia. Link in the description to them and all these regiments if you are interested in joining in on the action. There you go, boys. Keep that fire up. Keep that fire. If you got, if you got one shot, be accurate. So the Union has cap now, which I'm very happy to see here. Now we've got 11 minutes. The ticket balance has evened out as well here after that failed charge. I do not know why you're going forward, though. I would stand back and let them come to you in the open here. And I would anchor my position on this strong point here with the caissons. 
Now, if I was a CSA, I would put my priority here to reseize these caissons and just walk it up because the point actually extends very far out here. So you could have like a couple units like right about here shooting down into the Union in the open and use most of your guys on the coverage from the caissons and very easy shots for the Yardy. Hanging out in the woods, I think, is a mistake for the CSA right now. I know it's been working for you up till now, but I think you are giving the Union a good opportunity here to have a very strong position. Okay, who is moving out on the flank? It is Zio Panama from the 2 Corps. Okay, boss, uh, reloader here. Where is he? Here comes Gene. I think he's uh, not quite sure where he's going. I think you're silhouetting himself a little bit too much here. I think I would have gone a little bit deeper into the flank here to avoid fire. On the line, boss. No. I think they're shooting at us. He's going to come stop right here and uh, turn and face the enemy under this bit of a defilade. Okay. Those guys are going to go get their flag. Boys, take the opportunity if you're not loaded. We're being shot at, I think. This line? We are being shot at. Move it up. Up to the line, up to the line. Follow, boy. Yeah, don't Independent worry, fire at the caissons, right ahead. Independent fire. Fire at will, boys, fire at will. Stay here and load, stay here and load. Four will. You can pull it back, find the it tree if you want to take cover. You can take, use the tree, you can definitely. I would Four. absolutely take it behind the tree and take cover. You do not have. You got a little bit of tickets, but not too many here. Looks like 11th MS stopped a couple guys from getting their flags back. Good awareness by 11th MS. I, yeah, like I said, I would just anchor on this defensive position here. Let the enemy come to you. This, this, I, I'm nervous about being this far out here for the 11th MS, but we'll see if it works for them. They're running away from us. It's a success push, boys. They're about to come into the bush. fire up, boys. the fire Try to spread. Yeah, they're Union is now at taking losses. 23 on the main clock, 8 20 on the counterattack clock. Yeah, we'll hold it. We're giving up the skirmishing unit. They've got back to reload. You've got new lines coming. I just see it. Stop, stop, stop. Yeah, NYV's not going to be able to hold this with that second unit. I could be able to hold against these two units. Oh shit! Incoming, full unit. South, direct south, direct south, in pen fire. In pen uh, fire it's too late, south. mate. You gotta run. <laughs> We're gonna get charged out. Yeah, we flag run. Flag, 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 flag run. Flag run. Go to the rear. Go to North Northwest. Go to the rear. Yep. All right, just do a pull back to the eighth. Back to the eighth. Back to the eighth. He tried to warn you. Again, I think this is the right direction of attack for the CSA. Reseeds this position. That is the key from the CSA right now. And then just pelt the Union with already and infantry and recap at your pleasure. Yeah, I was up. Nice, nice. Oh, limp dick bastards. Get up. What are you doing? Come on, bro. Play it in, buddy. Come on, see that shoot. Yeah. not in that time yet. See how strong this position is as a defensive position. The caissons are the best, some of the best cover in the game. Back to the cannons and reload from there. Back to the cannons, reload from there. And the nice thing about it, as you can see, there is really not a great avenue of approach to attack that position from. It's mostly wide open, so you can engage it from a good amount of distance here. Let's see, six minutes thirty left. Uh, let's see, 11th MS is heading out to this right again. I, hmm. Six minutes. Keep on the back, keep on the back. Again, I think these CSA elements here are making a mistake by staying so far on this flank here. I think you, again, attack that position. Alright, we do have 11th MS has come up to this hill. Maybe to do a flanking attack? I'd be nervous about being out of position. Alright, they came back to the main point to defend it. 
Reload, stay where you are. Reload. 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 Hey, stay, stay, stay. Uh, Bron, there is a flag in front of us. Do you want me to go for it? Uh, go on then, go pick it up. Ah, déjà prenez the trapeau. Company, take it. Check it, boys. South get, east. get. South east. Oh, South east, gentlemen. Company. Fire. Ah. About face, fall back. Five minutes remaining. Union has really turned this battle around. Okay, here we go. Here's an attack here by the HL, joined by 4th New Jersey. Two-pronged attack here. We've also got Fort Georgia coming in. This is exactly what you need to do, in my opinion, as a CSA. This is the key decisive point. Ah, uh, but the Union is coming in. M 11th MS, very wisely, Pistol Pete coming in, in my opinion, to aid and hold this position and make sure it's secured. Good shit, good shit, good shit, good shit. Look Incoming. on the left, look on the left, matter what. Get ready for a counter, counter, get ready right. for a counter. All right, so it's still a fight here. It is a nail biter. We will see. Larry well, them MS, really, in my opinion, that was. That might be a game-saving move by them coming in timely to do that reinforcement here. But, oh, wait a second here. Who is coming in? It is Gene. He is going to come in to try to finish the job here. The loss of this position is, I think, going to be a big problem for the Union. I would say 5th Corps needs to go in and attack forward now. And make sure you hold this position here. I know that you want to stay on the point, but... I don't think you can hold the point if you lose this position here, not with three minutes remaining. Oh, and the CSA has won. Yeah, we'll see what happens now here. Eddie's going to come up to try to uh, contest this a little bit, but these guys here are going to get slaughtered by already an infantry concentrated fire here. We'll see, though, if they can hold with these four flags. There we go. So it begins. Good positioning by Eddie to try to draw some attention. Now the thing about the CSA is they don't need to fully come up here. They can move up a little bit and still contest the point. So we will see if they do that. So far they haven't. Keep up that fire! Suppress those cannons! Alright, so it looks like the CSA is mounting for another attack. Um, I don't like the uh, flank around on the uh, left side. I think that's a little bit too spread out. But we'll see if it works. And this attack I like a lot better, kind of coming up around the flank here of the Union. And crossing the T on him. Already making a good shot there. And collapsing Allen, this flank. Alan, get that flank and run. Get that flank and run. Can't hold this position, guys. We should not be reloading. Oh, boy, far for now, boys. Oh, hold the line. Independent, Independent fire. Lord Bone Bow, boys. Independent fire. All right, we'll see if that flank attack works out now. It is Jean and the HL, and they have succeeded in tearing off the NYV. That is going to be a problem. And a flank attack worked out. H A and, a and v. NYV took the bait, I think, by mistake. And that will allow this element here to get isolated. They're in our line, boys. Now, the nice thing for the Union is the CSA is going to be very close to uh, last stand when this is over. Oh, these guys didn't charge in. Are they just, are they on point? They will get their tickets back. There's that already coming in. 
But the problem is, as you're killing these men, you're getting less tickets back. So now you're going to only go up to full breaking. It was more important for the CSA to retake the uh, points with a higher union morale stake. Getting it down lower actually hurts them at the moment. Keep on point! Stay on point! Ten seconds! Stay on point! Guys, kill this fucking confederate. Pick up that Stay flag! Pick up that flag! Whoever wants to fucking pick it up, good shit, good shit. There you go. So now both teams are on breaking here at the 23 minute mark. CSA is now going to have to try to really hold on to uh, the point position here. It can't be so spread out. But a good counterattack from the CSA. He said, I'm a little, uh, I know it's fun just to shoot those guys out, but it was really more important for you to try to retake the point with the Union as high a morale state as you could have, so you could have recovered as much morale state as was possible. So just something to keep in mind with how the game functions. It's a little counterintuitive, but that's that's how the mechanic works. Ooh, nice shooting from the two USC. At least so, like, three dead bodies just drop on that. Eddie must have not shot. I've kill. shot people at 40 yards. Yeah, but at 40 well, yards, it's only got one. Well, aimed well aimed shot, man. Well aimed shot. Flag is taking time. They've got no flag or anything. Pick up the colors. All right, so it looks like the Union is going to reform at least part of them, the 11th yes, MS, yeah, back on the top of that mound. Well, Meanwhile, the CSA is being much more, much tighter towards the point this time. This, I think, is a mistake here. I, I, I would not... Yeah, you need to get out of here. You do not want to be trading tickets with a 2 USC like that in the open when you're this close to last stand. Uh, let's see, I imagine they're having a little bit of a conference back here, trying to decide what they want to do. Um, I would shoot it out for a bit. I would do some long-distance shooting, and just take your time and try to get um, as close to the last stand as you could before doing the uh, final push maneuver. Going forward as a CSA, I do not think is a good idea. Uh, this is very risky here by Cawthon. All right. Into line on the right of the 13th, march. Oh, jeez. 11th MS really got a twist on him. Uh, fall back, fall back for fall back. Hold! Hold! Independent fire! Oh, oh, here comes Fort George to aid him. And Colonel charge. Owens is going to charge in, as is HL. I guess the intent is to try to um, get him onto final push, but they have left the point wide open. I think you made a mistake here, gents, because now these guys are going to come up here and cap. What do you have to stop them? Well, everything MS is going to spawn back in. They'll go bayonets and go right to here. And you're going to have to cross open ground to get to the point. It's going to be up to, who is this right here? It's going to be up to Braun, really, to stop him. It looks like Braun gave a good accounting of himself, though. A really good accounting of himself. Excellent job. And that has given him time here for the rest of the CSA to move off and get back to point. And now they're going to catch these units coming in here. That came in a little bit too late. And they are going to get melted here. That was high risk by the CSA by going over there, but it might be high reward for them as well. Pull back now, pull back now, pull back now, run. Pull back now, pull back now, pull back now. Turn around and go. Independent fire on the front of his floor. On my right, keep up independent fire. All good, brother. We'll do that for a second. You 
did the right thing. Oh, you still got a unit over here. Oh, Lord, you can't have a unit isolated, man. Yep, so the realize he's going to try to get out of there. Uh, the CSA has gotten a little bit closer to getting him onto the last, to a final push. And they still have a bit of a ticket lead here. That's what 11th I thought it was a mistake to wipe out 11th MS up there, but uh, the Union really didn't capitalize on it and take the point, and part of that was also a really good hold by uh, 2 Corps, really weathering that attack and giving enough time for the rest of the CSA to come back in, so really nice job by that CSA team. Now, I would again not get into a shootout like this. Um, I would be doing the best I could to preserve my tickets right now. Um, again, they might be trying to go to put them on the final push. That might be the strategy. Again, another wide attack here, this time by HL. Man, I... Mm, I really think this is risky. On Baron, on Baron. Get out of here, boys. Get out of here. Good job, good job. French, French, French. Don't turn back. Oh, Gene is up. I think Gene might get away with it. Just keep moving, boys. Fuck, Gene, boys. Quick, quick, quick. Oh, bad place to stand. Yep. Five tickets. Don't stand to load. When your officer tells you to get out of there, that doesn't mean it's time for me to get my reload. It means it's time to go. Listen to the officer. Pistol Pete is going to try to carry this attack forward here. Again, don't get your reload when you get told to re run away. Buy more tickets. Right there was another five. That was a good uh, retrograde there by the HL. They turned around, got a firing line on a decent piece of ground, and uh, now the MS is going to have to fall back. Oh, that's a mistake again, in my opinion, because now you got another union up here, and they might just play that same game. Both CSA is getting close now to last stand. Oh, here comes Fifth Corps. Yep, HL got a little bit too overextended now. Here comes Fifth Corps. Going to chase him off and might get him down to last stand here before the Union goes to final push. That could be the key to this game. Definitely a bit of a seesaw going on right now. Alright. Oh, now there's a charge here into this. It is a general melee, and there we go. CSA has gone into last stand before the Union goes into final push. And this is not looking good now for the CSA. They may have been a little bit too aggressive there, a little bit too close to the sun, and they may have just thrown away what would have been a brilliant defense, but the game ain't over yet. On points, go on points. Yeah, you guys need to get on point too now. What are you doing over here? What are you doing? Still keep killing flags. Second US. I mean, you can leave one guy out here, but the rest of you should go to point and make sure they uh, take it. But, uh, okay. I suppose it's fine just to shoot him and keep him pinned down here. They're gonna hit us hard. Yeah. Ooh, watch out for that. Ah, the fence is gone, yeah. If they got a straw hat, cut him up like a fucking onion in an infomercial. Right, like this guy. Oh, I'm gonna do what I have. Get on the fence. 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 This is it. Second cab, left and right defense cells. Good job to move up here by the two USC and the rest of those elements from the NYV. There's the final push. But I think the Union has it now. Especially with that flanking attack coming in now. But we'll see. 
And that should be it. A hard fought victory here by this Union team. But a well done defense by the CSA. Just a little bit too aggressive at the end. They got to, uh, you know, worked a little bit for them a couple times, but I think it, uh, again, just pushed it a little bit too far. And that ends the match. Got one more to go, and my throat is parched here. Holy shit. I think the next one's Bloody Lane, too. So we'll see how that one goes, but that was a close one.